Okay, boys and girls, we've had the opportunity to look at some of the artwork by Henri Matisse. And what we're going to do is we're going to combine a painting technique and a collage technique and create an artwork that resembles something along the lines of this one here by Matisse of the goldfish. Now, what we need to do first with a piece of white paper, make sure your name is on the back, and this is one that I've started already, is with watercolours and just using the cool colours of water colours, blues, purples and greens, we're going to be creating a watery effect. So if you can see here, I'm just dabbing on the colours randomly, okay, spreading it across, and I'm going to fill the whole page up, okay? And I'm going to fill it up and then I'm going to set it to dry. When the whole page is filled, you should end up with something like this. This one's completely dry and it's ready for doing my fish bowl in a moment. So I'm just going to put that to the way. Now, next thing, we need a support piece of paper. So I'm going to get another piece of white paper. Next thing, I'm going to give you all a random supply of um, construction paper, rectangles and squares. And I want you to make up a random sort of like quilt pattern actually and all sorts of different colors now as you do it make sure that the background isn't showing through and you're going to keep doing that filling up randomly quilt you can overlap and layer okay and as I keep doing that until I'm completely satisfied with it and when you've got that done glue it down and again I have another one that I made earlier you should end up with something like that now we already have learned about how Matisse got sick and he started to do um, drawing with scissors basically to create collages and that's what we're going to do next so taking these random squares that we've got I want you to draw shapes in pencil and remember the shapes that we've already seen by him and then when you've got your shape drawing in pencil cut out the shape but I want you to keep both pieces so you've got a positive and a negative artwork okay so remember the positive is the object and the negative is the space around it so I'm just cutting this it looks a bit like an oak leaf okay so I'm going to keep this piece and this piece. I want you to do that with three different colours of construction paper and you're going to layer them again on your quilt, your patchwork quilt. And I've done some already, I did some earlier. I, I did a star. And you can place them anywhere you like. Now remember that these are going to be covered partially by the stool and the fishbowl that we're going to create. Okay, so there we are. I'm happy with that. So now it's starting to look a lot like what Henri Matisse did with his uh, drawing with scissors. This is great. This is your background. Make sure that everything is glued down. Now the next thing is I'm going to give you a template so that we get them all about the same size. If you can draw it yourself all the better. If not use this template. This a little stool and a piece of brown paper. Brown paper so it looks like it's wooden. Trace around it. Cut it out. When you've cut it out you should end up with a shape like that. Now set that to the base of your collage, okay? Now going back to your watercolour. Now to get a symmetrical bowl, and we've got quite a large piece of paper, so what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to fold it hot dog style, okay? I want you to do the same, it's completely dry, painting's on the inside. And I'm going to demonstrate just with a sharpie, but you can do this with a pencil. I don't want to have you doing it with a sharpie so it bleeds through. And to make a symmetrical pot, fish bowl basically, I'm just using the upper half. And the reason why I'm doing the upper half is that if you make a mistake, you can actually use the lower half, okay? And I'm going to cut that out. I'm going to follow the line that I drew. And I'm going to end up with a symmetrical object okay my fishbowl I'm going to set that to the side just in case I do need it if I made a mistake I'm going to open it up and there's my fishbowl now you're going to get a piece of orange paper same thing fold it over I'm going to demonstrate to you using the sharpie but again I want you to use a pencil for this because the sharpie does bleed through and I want you to draw a fish a goldfish okay So I'm just going to add some fins, right? 
and when you cut it out keep the paper folded cut it out and you'll end up with two fish when you end up with two fish you should end up with two symmetrical fish now if you have a fish bowl that's fairly large you can do what I did and I actually added an extra one in now when you've got all of that done then add a couple of eyes okay make sure that everything is glued down and there you go boys and girls there you have created your Henri Matisse collage okay you've painted the fish bowl you've layered the background as a patchwork quilt you've cut out shapes you've kept the positive and negative shapes you have your stool you've got your symmetrical bowl and you've got your fish I want a minimum of two fish but you can add in three or four depending on the size of your bowl and remember if you make a mistake with your bowl you've got the backup base the bottom base as well just in case okay boys and girls now it's your turn let's go make some art let's go make some fauvist artwork just in the style of Henri Matisse